Was Noah a real person or not? Okay. Let's look at this from a different perspective. This would be a Bokore, Bokora Precision. Noah a real person or not? The ancient Americans called him Bokika, and he was real. Now, in Sumer, he was Zasudra. Later on, later on, the Akkadians called him Udnapishtim, the exact same person. The reason they called him Udnapishtim was because it was prefixed with Utu, Udnapishtim. Utu was the latest of the Sumerian gods. He was the sun. The reason he was the latest is because the Sumerian pantheon was developed under the vapor canopy when there was no sun. But the Sumerians were still around when the vapor canopy collapsed. Therefore, they introduced a new god. They called it the sun because they had never seen the sun before. It was a violet, dark sky in the daytime. And at nighttime was almost as bright as the daytime because the stars were magnified and the moon was absolutely brilliant. And so was the star Venus, Ashtoreth. It was Venus. It was super bright because the mesosphere that we call the vapor canopy magnified the heavens at night like a giant lens. It is the reason why uh, so many traditions mention stars that cannot be seen by the naked eye today. Now, uh, Noah, Noah was remembered in many of these ancient traditions, but never before was it ever surmised or get or even it even put out that he lived an inordinate amount of years. That was a Jewish fiction because when the Jews were were captives in Babylon, they were going through the Babylonian libraries and they came across the nerve system of every six hundred years, and they learned the same thing that occultists teach today that the ancient 600 year great year period identified the exact years in world history when a great one was born so they incorporated this the system and they nailed it they 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 nailed the birth of noah and they said he and said he was born and that this is this is what they did they put together different systems one was the the flood hero epos then they put together the neurochronology of 600-year epics. They merged them together, and they created that Noah was born 2839 B.C., 600 years before the Great Flood in 2239 B.C. He, he was a, the flood happened in his 600th year. None of that is found in any of the Near Eastern or the or the Hindu Hindu texts. And there's a lot of Hindu texts about about uh, Genesis history. As a matter of fact, it may have come from the, the Hindu texts, but uh, no. He was a real person as far as the histories go, but he didn't live 600 years. That was something that the Jews attached to him because they totally misunderstood the things that they were reading and when they were putting them together to put their Genesis narrative together.